All right, here we go. Fallout 4, after saving and quitting and coming back to it. Where are we now? What room am I in? Which way am I going? Uh, there's a little sense, there's like a northeast, southwest map. Oh, I see. I should have realized this while playing the game. I want to be going towards what up up that little green block is. I want to be heading towards that little green block. Um, but it's more tricky than that because some th there's obstacles in the way. The block assumes that you have a straight 360 degree straight pathway to there. That was just me playing with the controls. I can see the back of myself. So I'm looking around. Where am I going? Am I going the right way? Oh no, okay, there's these frozen ice people. So we already saw that, so we're going the other way. So where am I going? And why are there so few enemies? There's like, compared to Fallout 3, there was at least like rad roaches. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm basically alone. And Okay, so it's telling me go this way, but I didn't realize it was telling me to go that way. Um, so I can press R2 to attack, uh, which swings my baton, and there's a rad roach, I kill it, and I overkill it, and then I harvest its meat, because when you eat the meat of the animals, red ro or the creatures that you eat, that, that you kill. Oh, another baton, that's good. When you eat the meat of the creatures that you kill, you get a little radiation, but you also um, gain hit points. And it's not much, but anything that can keep your health up in this game is really essential. So where are we going now? It, the sign on the door says, go this way, but I didn't know that, but I went that way anyways. So here's this uh, Tesla coil, and I see the Tesla coil zapping out energy, and I don't want to walk past it. So I, I go this way to the mess hall. There's a few beers on the table. If I recall from Fallout 3, beers are valuable, and you can drink them. You can become an alcoholic uh, if you want to, but I recommend for Fallout. You don't take any drugs at all, um, but you can sell them, which makes you a bit of a hypocrite, I guess. So what's in here? Hot plate, I'll take that. Coffee cup, I already have a coffee cup. You, you could just, you could sell scrap goods, um, depending on who you're selling it to, for a few caps. Caps are the currency of the Fallout world. So, welcome to this computer. It, this is basically just the PlayStation inside the Fallout world. Um, so, it's offering you, offering to play a game. And here we go, we're gonna play a game. Red Menace, oh, which is definitely not another game that looks exactly, more or less exactly like this. Uh, so I'm running, I've, I've, I've basically, pl no, there are differences, like, but I, I, I've basically played this game before, so I can get by it pretty easily. Don't let. Oh, but I... No, I should have gone backwards. No, why didn't I go backwards? Okay, I'm dead. Uh, do I... Okay, my next try. Quit. This... I didn't... I didn't pay 70 bucks to play a game from, like, 1978. As good as... And uh, groundbreaking as that game is. So, but you can take the tape. You can take the cartridge with you, and I would guess that's worth money, or you just want to hang on to it. Um, I'm surprised these uh, control access don't 
you can't do anything with them. You could sleep in the bed, I know that for sure. Uh, anything at the foot of the bed? Not that I can see. I'm really not exploring as much as I could be. I could be going to every log nook and cranny in this game and uh, go on. Uh, find all the little secret treasures. Anything in here? It doesn't even give me an option. Okay. These are open and broken. It, 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 you can sometimes find things in there. So this must have been the barracks. And there's nothing in here. Slowly looking around. So I'm going to go to the exit. And this is the mess hall, I presume. I didn't even open the refrigerator. Oh, oh. Why did I not do that? <laughs> I already talked to that computer. So, here we go. This Is this the right way? I don't know which way to go. And there's no enemies, or there's nothing, just eerie sound, eerie fallout sound. Going on. Okay, so, let's go in here. I will not go through the energy, but around it. That's a good idea. So, maybe if I was brave and went through the energy, I could get something. Killed a rad roach. So far, the rad roaches have been easy, very easy to kill. I'll two to... Oh, block. Yeah. I usually don't block in games, but that's good to know. What uh, happened here? Where is everyone? Freaked out by the skeleton. What is happening down there? Open. Uh, he. he he didn't even open that up? Oh my. Okay. So there's a whole bunch of rivals just coming at me. I step back because I don't want to be hurt by rad roaches. And then I go up. And there's a rad roach. <laughs> Kills it. And it get the rad roach meat. I must have a lot of meat by now. Do I want to drink the water? Do I sit? Do I trust the water? Okay, I drank it and I gained health. It's a good thing. Alright. So, open this door. Hey, this looks just like the terminal in Fallout 3 where you leave the vault. But, I guess it deems some investigation. Dead person. Oh, it looks like that door over there leads to somewhere. But let's just read this computer. Okay, so you can read this, pause and read it if you want. There you go. I think I got distracted by something, is why I'm looking at the screen for so long. Or maybe I'm a bad reader. It, it was morning and I had not had my coffee yet. Speaking of which, I think I'll have a cup of coffee. Okay, so...
reading about what happened, how they all died. Doesn't give you a complete picture, but what does the overseer do in the vault? I don't know if I like or dislike all this text in the game. It feels like a very like audio visual game. I suppose to like. I mean, all of this text is basically just subplot. So here we are. And to be fair, I was drawn in by the subplot. Okay, so. final area of the computer. Dancing, dancing. You're playing follow, but you should be on the dance floor. So, overseer's log, uh, the, and then we can open the door. The plot really is interesting if you're like playing the game and like it's been so intense and overwhelming, and then you just sit back and read about what has been happening. How it used to be intense and overwhelming. So read on. There's only so much I can narrate about the fact that you're reading something. <laughs> People don't like it well. And that's the final bit right there, I think. And the door to the outside is open. So I did not try to challenge the overseer. I did not try to kill the overseer for all this loot. But now there's all these uh, rad roaches. And I have to. They're all rushing me. And I can only take on so many at once. Ah, uh, there's one at my feet. I have to look down. No. Get it? Okay, got it. That took a. Bit. Oh. That took a fair bit of health to get all those red roaches. I'm at like 60% health. So is there a water fountain or something nearby? That's, well, let's think, should we eat the meat or should we drink the water? First we're gonna save. 
and just like in Final Fantasy, it's, it blocks off how you save goes. So where's this water fountain, if there is a water fountain? Look around. There's the water fountain. So drink it, will it it'll irradiate me? Uh, no, well, it, I think this is worth it for full health, or 95% health. I could have got to full health, but I am playing cautious. So going uh, out, out of the vault. Open up this door. Where are we going now? See, at this point, I didn't know the little old tag on the door meant that's the way you should be going. But, oh well. And... Kill a red roach. Who is eating a dead scientist, it looks like. Well, it looks like the, the, that's how the red roach has survived here in this vault. Creepy. Did anyone get out? So the creepy dead people. Everyone's dead. I was just hoping I could get something off of them. So where are we? That looks like the exit there. So how do we get to the exit? Oh no, I'm being attacked by something. Am I being shot? No, it's a red roach. Okay, kill the red roach. Ha take his meat. Turn it on. Pip-Boy interface required to activate vault door cycling sequence. I need a Pip-Boy. Nice Where do I get a Pip-Boy? Well, I remember the scientists had Pip-Boys. Am I the only one left? So, where is a Pip-Boy? Dead body. Dead rad roach body. Oh, here. What about this guy? Hey, there, there's the pit boy so if I examine this... Oh, this is uh, unpleasant. <laughs> but it's what I need to get out of here. And it actually shows you with the strap how you turn it, attach it on. It's not like glued on to your neurons, your blood, blood veins and everything. Okay, so Pit Boy booting up. It's weird they show a boot up screen for the Pit Boy. <laughs> it's going the extra mile. So you can go through the various menus within the Pit Boy map. So the map, and I don't know what that means. Okay, I'm not going to mess with it too much, but I am going to turn on the vault opener. And then Should it, okay, he is looking. Opens up the vault. Now how do I get out of here? I better get out of here before that alarm attracts something bad. I better hurry. Oh, the light of day. Whoa, the sun. That's how I feel when I wake up in the morning. I know how to jump though, so I don't need that ramp. No, I'm not gonna jump into the, uh, into the stairs. Hey, I remember this. The 
this is how I came in. Very dramatic. Very, very dramatic. And I get to change my stats, tweak them to what I want if I didn't like them in my little demo experience. This is information, this is a loading screen, but it's showing you information about those pods that freeze you. So whenever they load something, they sh show you a little demo of something in your game. Uh, uh, what is this? I'm exiting. I can't stand the sight of this, the sun. <laughs> Ah, uh, mission. I have missions in this. So my eyes are adjusting to the sun. And the glare is going away. It's probably better out in the sun than inside a vault full of dead people and cockroaches. I can't, like, I can't take stuff from the, their bodies. Oh, Radix, that's good. Nuka-Cola bottles, I'm sure they're worth something. Where, what else is there in here? I'm gonna save. Save now that I'm out of the, uh, the vault. And first aid. Oh, those are all good things that I want. First aid boxes are the best. So I'm looking at my inventory. I don't know where my max weight is. I don't know how much I can hold before I have to put it away. So I'm just wandering around. All these blown up cars and trailers. It's probably like 200 years later. Hey, uh, my first bottle cup. Uh, I got some bullets for a gun that I don't have. Switchblade, awesome, but I'm going to stick with the baton. Okay, and we're through. What is L3? How, how do I press L3? I just tried to press L3. And I think it blocked. Oh, herbs, so I can build a campfire. Now I'm obsessed with finding more herbs. Okay, so we'll just walk around. Hey, a bridge, it's good to cross bridges. Yay! And I think we have just found ourselves a little town called Sanctuary. Uh, but there's no town people around. Walk around. What's in this house? Let's, let's just loot everyone's house. Walk around. There's nothing, is anything, oh, am I being attacked? Yes, kill that rat roach. My health is still pretty good. But is there anything in the distresser suitcase? It's locked, but I don't have a bobby pin. You use bobby pins to unlock stuff in here. Awesome, another first aid box. That is very good. 
Maybe this is a sanctuary. So we're looking around, getting attacked. Have to keep it. Uh, keep those red roaches. Is he alive? No, I'm. I'm holding him. Okay. So, where do we go now? Just look around. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. The compass at the bottom, I, I was hoping dog meat would be in here. Um, dog meat is the name of the dog in Fallout 3. Um, the compass at the bot bottom center of my s screen should be telling me where I should be orientating myself to. Excuse me, I have the hiccups. Um, so, going around. I have to record that I had a bowel movement earlier today. Okay. So we're moving along and the only reason I stopped where I stopped is because the save data finished right now just looking around nothing in here Oh, I should check that out. Yeah, I may as well take these. Okay. So what's this? I can't pick it up. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a lawnmower, probably. Uh, anything in there? Yeah, I'll take a tan suit. But right now, I'll keep watching my wearing my uh, vault clothing. So here we are. Still haven't met anyone, but also kind of trying to stay away. What's that? Oh, it's a bloat fly. I want to kill the bloat fly because so far all I have killed was rod roaches. So I'm finding a way to the front door. Here we are. And go after the bloat fly. Boom. 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 Oh, there's a bunch of them. Boom. 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 I took a lot of damage. And I took some radiation. But the game is about over for now. So what are we going to do? Look around. Do I want to drink the water? I can't drink the water. 
can't get through. 